Physical is keeping time always, but there are dimensions within you which are not related to time. Only little initial guidance may take time. Namaskaram Sadhguruji, mm -hmm. um, I'm Rinda. So my question is, um, how can one uh, spend a balanced time in academics and spirituality or maybe career and spirituality? See, uh, anything that you do with your body is connected to time, it takes time. You want to run, you want to walk, you want to do this or that, everything takes time. What you do with your mind? also takes time but not to the same extent enslaved to time. I mean, our sense of time is only because of our body. You don't have to look at your watch to know what is the time. If you observe your bladder, you know how many hours you've been sitting here <laughs> I'm saying our sense of time is essentially because of body. We had sense of time even before the watch came, isn't it? Because physical is keeping time always. How long you can sit here, how long you can walk, how long you can do something, everything is decided by time. Time may be a relative experience at different times. You have seen at a certain time when you're very joyful one day, twenty-four hours, poof, went like a minute. Another day you're little depressed, I'm sorry, clinically depressed. <laughs> then that one day feels like a whole lifetime. So. When somebody is very miserable, you will see time just won't roll. So time is a very relative experience, but still it's very directly connected to our body. If we did not have a body, suppose you don't have a body, you sit here for ten thousand years, what's the problem, isn't it? So when it comes to the mind, it is not as much enslaved to time as your physical body, but mind also has time. But there are dimensions within you which are not related to time. So, this thing about right path, wrong path, all these things largely relates itself to body because it takes time, it takes away life. If you just take a wrong turn, it'll take away life. Maybe you lost half an hour, but you lost not half an hour of time, you lost half an hour of life, isn't it? So when it comes to physical things, we must be little conscious of which turn to take because it takes away our time. Mentally, you can take any turn you want, whichever way you want because it doesn't take much time. So when you talk about spiritual process, it doesn't take time at all, it's an inner dimension which doesn't relate to time. So your education, you may be studying, you may be running, you may be working, to be spiritually doesn't take time, only little Initial guidance may take time, afterwards it doesn't consume time because it's not physical in nature.